crazy creative kitchen so today we're gonna be making fried chicken we're gonna be doing two different types of fried chicken today we're gonna do one that's called uh, barbie fry and we're gonna do one that's just my personal fried chicken recipe and for this fried chicken recipe i'm using a cowboy barbecue spice so right now i'm just cutting up my chicken then i'm gonna wash clean seasoned my chicken and get ready for the fried chicken recipe and if you've never had fried chicken I think uh, the best fried chicken out there they say is KFC but I personally think the best fried chicken comes from the south because in the south they fry their chicken in chicken grease so I think the best fried chicken comes from the south so right now we've cut up our chicken so what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna wash my chicken with some lemons and some water so i'm gonna wash and clean my chicken with some lemons and some water then i'm gonna drain it and then i'm gonna season it with my dry rub so I'm going to wash, get all that stuff out of there, make sure it's nice and clean. Then I'm going to season my chicken with my dry rub. And if you don't know about my dry rub yet, is my dry rub is garlic, onion, chicken spice, and Larry's seasoning salt. And that's my dry rub. Most of the time, that's what I use garlic powder onion powder chicken seasoning and larry's seasoning sauce so now we're gonna season our chicken we're gonna give it a little rub give it a little massage and get it ready for our frying process so we're gonna season this and we're gonna set it aside and then we're gonna go make our fry batter so the fry batter we're using today is regular counter flour I'm adding some granulated garlic then I'm gonna add some onion powder then I'm gonna add some black pepper and the key ingredient for this fried chicken batter is my cowboy barbecue mix then i'm gonna give that a little i'm gonna give it a little sieve just to get all the, the the get a little air inside my mixture so i give that a little sieve and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna just put our chicken in there massage or batter and i don't use eggs when I make fried chicken, I never use eggs. What I do is I use oil and then I massage my batter on my chicken with both hands and that's how I make my fried chicken. Then what I do is I start with a high flame. As soon as I drop my chicken in, I reduce my flame and then at the end I bring my flame back up to make that nice crispy skin so you want to shake the excess flour off so that's what we're doing now is we're shaking off the excess flour then we're gonna go over to our heated oil and we're gonna put our chicken in so this is our oil and we're putting our chicken in or oil and so now what's gonna happen is 
because you put a lot of chicken in it's gonna cool down the the oil but that's good for the chicken so you put the chicken in it cools down the the oil and then it start to steam a little bit so it gives a little boiling but that's good for the chicken so once it starts to fry again means your chicken is you know it's getting there your chicken's getting there and once it starts to crisp up what you want to do is you want to reduce your flame a little bit more you know because you want that chicken to cook all the way to the bones you don't want the bones to be thin so right after that process you want to when it starts to go you want to just turn your oil up a little bit so turn your oil up a little bit and let it crisp up this is my barbecue sauce what i do with this is i take regular barbecue sauce i add a little pineapple juice to thin it out you don't want it to be too thick when you do the barbecue sauce so add a little pineapple juice and you thin it out so you can spoon it onto your chicken that's all you want to do you don't want to pass the chicken spoon it on to your chicken so now you see that chicken see how crispy that looks now our chicken is done so we're gonna remove the chicken from the oil we're gonna put it on wax paper so it drains we're gonna put our barbecue sauce on our chicken and we're gonna put it in the oven at 350 for four minutes four to five minutes so wax paper put our chicken then we're gonna add our barbecue sauce we're gonna spoon the barbecue on both sides so that's all you want to do is you want to just spoon your barbecue sauce on both sides of your chicken then we're gonna put it in the oven for four to five minutes because you don't wanna you don't want your chicken to be too soft you want to still keep it with that crispy skin so we're gonna do that then we're gonna flip them over and we're gonna do the other side then we're gonna put it in the oven so we flip them over and do the other side then we're gonna put it in the oven and we're gonna cook it again just so the barbecue sauce you want all that sugar to come out of your barbecue sauce and that's the main reason why you put it back in the oven because you want that sugar you want that sugar to just pop out of your your barbecue sauce that caramelization process so now we're ready for barbecue fry versus regular fry and as always hit the like button drop me a comment let me know if you have ever tried barbecue fried chicken let me know your views on fried chicken in general and as always crazy chef like share subscribe